G'day ladies and gentlemen, Friday here and welcome to Stardew Valley. Yeah, this is an absolutely brilliant little game and it's made by one person. Unbelievable. So yes, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be playing this game. And pretty much it's like a, well, I kind of think it's like Terraria, but like in not is in like as a 2D platform, but it's more like a 2.5D, uh, which is not really 3D. But anyway, uh, yeah, but otherwise it's it's a farming simulator game and you get given a farm and you've got to... Sorry, it's, 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 I thought Audacity stopped on me for a second. Then. But uh, yeah, no, you've got, you've been given a farm or you inherited a farm from your grandfather and yeah, you've got to survive. But anyway, we'll find out more because, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to start a new game. All right, what are you going to be called? Well, I think probably be Pied... I will, if, if I actually spell my name right, will be, you know, third time lucky there, you know. Um, what are we going to be called? Legendville, oh, oh my god, jeez, learn to spell pie, seriously, we're going to be called Legendville Farm. And our favourite thing, favourite thing, okay, that's a bit of an odd one to ask, because it's kind of just, mm, yeah. <laughs> um... Uh, I don't know. Meatballs. And we're going to have a cat. Or a dog. Or a cat. Or a dog. I'm going to go with dog. Yeah, well, let's go with puppy. Okay. And you can rotate your character. And you can be male or female. Doesn't matter which one. Well, I'll, I'll actually go for male because, you know, just because. And you can pick all the different color skin types. You can be purple. You can be black. You can be purple again <laughs> you could be white you could be green you could be whatever color you want to be uh but i might stick with say yeah two looks good yeah and you can, you can spin it around actually it's not bad sort of a hairdo for me it's kind of just messy and stupid oh look at that go the fro go the fro woohoo no that's probably more like me anyway in real life just short and Scruffy. <laughs> uh, actually, you know, I'm going to get the fro. What the hell with it? I'm going to have a, I'm going to have a um, blonde fro. If I can kind of get the blondish colour. That's not really blonde, is it? Uh... <laughs> Go the blonde fro. It's kind of a, it's kind of like a, a dirty green, but anyway. I can't really do much better than that, I don't think. No, that's too... No. I think it's about the best I can do. Alright, you can actually also change your shirt. So we can either look for... Uh, skull? Weird pattern? It kind of looks like my shirt for uh, Minecraft. It looks like the... Um, the suit. The suit front. Yeah! Okay, we'll do that. Uh, pant colour, we'll go black. Or a slightly grey. Try and match the... No, 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 what are you doing to me? That's the ticket. There you go. Look at that. Awesome. <laughs> Accessories. Oh, look at that. Go the beard. You know, you know what that looks like, don't you? Go Bob Ross. Actually, we'll go the Bob Ross look because you know, just, just cause. Bugger it, and we'll leave the intro on just because. And I'm actually not going to do any talking through it. We'll just play through the intro. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That's it. It's the pie dude Bob Ross look. Although I probably should actually have the uh, hair color as more as an orangey color. Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. I don't care. Anyway, let's do it. The intro, ladies and gentlemen. I will talk through it. And for my very special grandson, I want you to have this sealed envelope. Thanks, Pops. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Oh, come on. Silly old coot. Now, listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life.
I don't actually know why I'm speaking like that, but I just am. And your bright spirit will fade before the growing emptiness. That's deep. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Fully sick. <laughs> now let Grandpa rest. XX years later. Yoja. Or Jo or Jo Joya? Joja? Yoja? I'll say Joja. Nah, <laughs> he got sacked. Looks like um It looks like Woody. Hey, there's me, the fast asleep. Wake up, scrub. Oh, I think I just wet myself. Oh, no, he's unhappy. Right, sorry, my bad. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Dear Pi Dude, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. Oh, sorry, I got the, I got the voice wrong. Dear Pi Dude, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and, and uh, with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy. Legendville Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I want you to I want your I know you'll honour the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will you? Okay. I will. Jumping on the bus and go to the seaside. Do do. <laughs> say, look, I'm driving the bus. Stardew Valley, half a mile. Do 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 do. Sign falls over when the bird lands on it. <laughs> oh, I think somebody just shot the bus. Oh, now it's taken off. Hello, you must be Pi Dude. Hey, Robin. I'm Robin. Now oh, I kind of guess that because your name says there. The local carpenter, Mayor Lewis, sent me here to fetch you and show you show you to the way to the new home. He's he's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here. If you'll follow me, okay. Lead the way. Awesome. Didn't take long to get there. Look at that fro. That's something to be proud of. This is Legendville Farm. Ah! He's wet himself again. <laughs> What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good sort of... I don't need to read it, because you guys can read it. I'm not, I'm not going to try and put voices on, because I'm just terrible at them. I did the grandpa voice, but, you know, that was just the intro. I'm being, being silly. <laughs> oh, okay. Meh. It could be worse. It could be a bigger dump than that. Hey. Oh, it's Lewis. Okay. Hey, the old codger says hi. Welcome. Thank you, Mayor Lewis. Pelican Town. <laughs> yes, it is a big deal. Because the family is back. We are back and we are going to make some monies. <laughs> the old grandpapa's place. It sure is rustic. Haha, <laughs> thanks Robin. Krusty? <laughs> get out of here. Rude! I called it. <laughs> uh, this has, okay. Oh, alright, okay, you're gonna try and make you buy stuff. Haha, <laughs> and now you're wetting yourself. <laughs> uh, okay. Yep. 
let's get on with it. We're probably a good 10 minutes into this recording, or probably, you know, 8 to 10 minutes, and haven't even actually started yet. We've just been watching intro. Yeah, I know that people would appreciate it. Okay. We're nearly done. Dun, 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 dun. So chucking stuff. What? Well, no. Actually, because <laughs> I have played this previously just to, you know, well, for a number of hours, actually. I didn't actually mean to play for as long as I did, but uh, I did. Um, but yeah, oh, I kind of got hooked. And when I first saw this, you stand right next to the letterbox, thought, what, you're gonna put, you want to put junk in the letterbox? I suppose it beats the other junk that normally gets chucked in the letterbox anyway, I guess. Hey... Is the annoying farm noises? Your progress has been saved. Okay, woo! Okay, so you can hold down shift and run, or I think actually there is uh, option auto run. Putting that damn thing on. Because hell yeah, as if we wouldn't. Oops, ooh, parsnip seeds. You receive 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you start. Oh, to get you started. Lord, Lord Lewis? Try Mayor Lewis. Jeez. All right. Okie dokie, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. We are finally in game. Took long enough. <laughs> and one thing I will actually say is that um, I'm actually going to be um, doing chunk recordings so i'm going to probably play for like a probably good hour or so and i'm going to upload like 15 20 minute episodes because i'm actually going to start doing that from now on because you know there are times where i can't actually record and you know hey this is a good way of being able to put out videos when if there's a time i can't actually record all right i just want to get that out there before we start all right so now we're going to be starting playing okay so you obviously got to clear up because we need to start a farm area and we've got so much crap in the way We've got plants, and the best thing to use for these is the scythe. Or the scythe. Oop. Okay. Oop. Buttons fail. <laughs> Pick up these rocks. No. Key bindings off. Now, I might actually see if we can move some of these around. I might just. Uh, plonk that there. Uh, yeah, that looks good for now. See if I, I'll see if I get it right or if I completely cock it up. I'll probably cock it up, but that's okay. Alright, no, we're doing good. I think we're doing good. So that's all we're going to be doing for now for this bit, is we just want to get a bit of a starting area. Give you that junk. Oop. Alright, oop. Wrong button. <laughs> Yeah, no, we're good. I can hit the right button, not a problem. And I still hit the wrong button. Oh, actually, I just missed my just missed the button. So, we'll get this stuff cleared. What, what? Oh, there you go. Sorry. I couldn't work out what that was. So, I'll get this nice big area cleared all around the front here. It should be awesome. Can I cut this thing down? Can. Sweet. I'll get these little saplings out of the way. And you'll see in the bottom bottom left corner, uh, bottom left, bottom right corner. Well, the bottom left shows you what you just picked up, but the uh, bottom right corner um, actually shows your energy bar. And of course, if this gets too far down, uh, or basically if it runs out, you'll basically just collapse on the ground and you'll uh, need medical attention. <laughs> and you get stung for it too, <laughs> which is typical. Uh, so I'm not going to do much more. I'm going to just want to get this bit cleared out. Oop, down it goes. Tree down. Nice. Okay. Pick up that stuff and cut these. And I'm going to make just a little bit of a pathway there. Just clear out this. See. Excellent. That'll do. All right. Let's use the who. Um, mm -hmm. oh, got some mixed seeds there too. Okay, so I'm trying to think how am I going to do this? Mm. Ooh. How about say we'll just start here? Uh, oh, oh, no, 
I just want to put that there. That's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, we've got 15, haven't we? Derp. Come on. It's a little fiddly. The controls. But you get there. Ah. It's like if you just look just the wrong way, he uh, completely derps it up. All right. Let's plant some seeds. You can also get some fertilizer. But... We're not there yet. Oh, actually... No, I'm not there yet. <laughs> That's okay. Ooh, you can actually make a little campfire. Hey, I'm not going to do it yet, though. Uh, one thing I do want to get, though, is a chest, because I want to be able to dump stuff into it. So we'll be aiming for that. And then you get 50 wood. What have I got? Uh, 32. Ooh, okay. But we'll get these things watered. Because the first thing you do every single day is when you wake up, you got to water your plants. And you can get a sprinkler system later on, but, you know, we're a long way off that. Okay. Because I know we was told to go, you know, visit the uh, town folk, but... Pff, poo them. They can wait. <laughs> the town's folk can wait. Because I want to get my farm going. Because I need to make monies. Alright. Oop. Uh, what have we got? 35... Grab that. Can't cut that one down. My axe isn't strong enough. I'm going to have to upgrade. Because you can go mining and there's combat. There's all sorts of awesome stuff in this. And, and again, as opposed to people probably know, this game is pretty much sort of based off of... Um, was it Harvest Moon? Or, and... Uh, I can't think. Animal something? I don't know. I actually have never played either... Um, animal, was it Animal Crossing? No? I can't think what it is. But either way, I don't really care. I've never actually played either of them. So, I don't care. To me, this is a brand new game, and it's freaking cool, and I'm playing it. <laughs> it's as simple as that. I don't really, I really don't care what it was potentially based off or anything. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, see, I'm exhausted. And it's only one o'clock in the... Yeek. There you go. I was not paying any attention whatsoever. Well, that's not good. Uh... And I've got nothing that can actually increase my energy at the moment. The one good thing, though, is actually walking around actually does not waste um, energy, which is good. But that's done. The farm is now done, and we will... Oh, I shall already see these eyes, but uh, I'll have a look inside anyway. Let's have a look. See what the weather's going to be tomorrow. Because you can look at your TV, and you can get your... Uh, the Kuzu, Kozu 5, or K0, ZU, V, I don't know, who cares. It's going to be clear and sunny all day tomorrow. Okay, sweet. You can also get a fortune teller. Oh, I see a glimmer in your scribing orb. Or scrying orb, I should say. The spirits are a good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Hmm, okay. And living off the land. Welcome to living off the land. Uh, we're back in with another tip for y'all. You want to draw your greenhorns out there, chop wood and search for wild, for wild forage to earn some extra cash while waiting for your first harvest. Good tip there, actually. <laughs> um, okay, so what are we going to do? We are going to craft a chest. That is definitely what we are going to be doing. Hmm, do I want to leave it inside? Or do I want to leave it out here? Actually, you know what? I'm going to leave it right there. Awesome. Excellent. So now we can just dump all these things. I probably should plant them, shouldn't I? Hmm. But at the moment, I don't have the energy really to do it, so I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not going to waste my time at this point. I uh, don't really need to lug that around. Oh, one thing with the watering can too is if it doesn't drain my energy too much, you can when you've got it selected, you can just. <gasps> okay, it didn't actually go down. But you just go to the watering hole and you top up your little watering can. Ta-da! And I'll dump that back in there. Ooh, fibre. Yeah. Actually, it's one thing I can do. So this is the box that the um, mayor was talking about. You can just walk up to it. And you dump things into it. Alright. Probably nothing I probably should also point out, since now we've done all that, is the getting started. 
these are pretty much just like a couple. You, throughout the game, you'll get constant quests and little achievement things you can do as well. And uh, yeah, that's cool. So this is the, this is the pretty much the first ones. Is you know got cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Oops, and you can click the back arrow, but you know I didn't do that. There it is, right there. And also to introduce yourself to the townsfolk, and there we've obviously met uh, Lewis and uh, I can't think of a name now. Robin. So yeah, we've got obviously we met two of them. We've got twenty six more people we can uh, meet. Sweet. And I really don't have much energy, so let's just uh, go for a bit of a wander. And one thing you can also do too, I know this is where we came from, but you can actually come through here. <gasps> you can actually find random things. Oh, actually, this is going to give us some extra energy. You can actually give the flowers to, to people. Because, you know, you can... The thing with this game is you can hook up with... Uh, well, depending on how you want to play the game. But you can you can hook up with the person of your dreams and you can settle down and get you know get married and have family and all that cool stuff as well. Um, I'm actually going to eat that. <laughs> Woohoo! Chomp. Because that is now going to increase my uh, energy a little bit. <laughs> I'm not going to give it to anyone. I haven't met anyone yet, so I don't know who to meet. Who I'm going to uh, want to hook up with. And... Alright. Let's have a look around. Doctor's place in here. It's locked. Open... Oh. Really? Oh, it's four o'clock. Okay. And this, is the, this is the daily thing. This is the little calendar. Um, obviously shows when their b people's birthdays are. Ooh, daily! And Pam, Shane, Emily, Pierre, Vincent. And there's obviously Lewis right there. And you got these little uh, carnival type things going on as well. Alright. Oh, hello. It's Abigail. Oh, that's right. I heard someone was moving into this farm. <laughs> I, won't, I won't do anything bad. Dodgy accents. I'll just read it if I need to. Okay, so that's one person. Well, you can still go out there and explore the fields. Oh, you don't have to buy yourself. Wink, wink. Who's this buffet? It's Sam. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you, dude. Idiot. <laughs> oh, more peoples? It's Pam. Pretty good. Name's Pam. I don't know why I was just thinking like that, just that's what she looks like. Oh, hey, so you're the new guy, huh? Cool. I know, I know, I shouldn't do the silly voice. I keep saying I won't do it, I keep doing it anyway. Whoop, it's Penny. Hi. Hi, Penny. Oh, did you want something? No, not at all. Malu? Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? Yes, I am. I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Oh, thanks, Maru. Nice glasses. I'm on you. It's Lee or Leah. I always say Lee, but it's Leah. Hello, it's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Yeah, fantastic. Okay, well, making some quick introductions here. Oh, shop's still open. Yep. It's Pierre. Hey, Mr. Podu, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. Looking for some seeds? My shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you. For a very good price. Okay, sweet. <gasps> and this is the ultimate thing too here. <gasps> it's the 24 slot backpack. Costs 200 gold. <gasps> of course, I'm nowhere near it. <laughs> well, I'm kind of close. But the thing is, I need to buy more seeds and stuff. So it's going to be a little while before we even hit that. No, unfortunately, no, I can't. Um, and he's, I think he's actually closed now. So I can't actually talk to him to buy his stuff. Let's go and meet Caroline. Hi, you must be Pido, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. My husband runs the general store here. And have you met my daughter Abigail? Yes, I have met Abigail. She's the one with the purple hair. Yep, we met her outside. And amazingly, she's now inside. Hey, Ab Abby, let me in. No, she's not going. Bugger. Okay, can't go into a room. <laughs> uh, I was poking you, you let Sam in, yeah, no, I was poking you. Okay, let's do a few more introductions. 
is everywhere. Hello. <laughs> uh, yes, thank you. Welcome. Awesome. Hey, Granny. I'll see you around. Thanks, Alex. He's George, the grumpy old bastard. <laughs> He's usually having meeting with any people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. <laughs> yeah, dude, you're in a wheelchair. You can you, you can be some serious pain. I wouldn't be freaking carrying on too much. Oh, that's Mario. Yep. You know, small town like this is uh, new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. Sure is. Uh, that's Penny. He doesn't want to speak to me again. And, okay, nothing in there. Who else can we meet? Anyone? Before it gets too damn... Ooh, that was because I keep an eye on that. Oh, who's this? Oh, that's the... It's Quint! He's the blacksmith. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm the guy. Thank you very much. Cheers, Clint. Is this thing open? I bet it's not. Not this time of day, no. Okay. It's locked. Open, thank you. That's actually like the library slash museum y thing, which we'll check out later anyway. Ooh. Daft you. So, one thing, yeah, as I said with the uh, tip, you know, while you wander around checking your way for your crops to grow, peel for all you can. <laughs> oh, you can also loot the rubbish bins. Oh, I found an amethyst in the bin. Booyah! Oh, really? Dang it. Nope, didn't get anything in that one. <laughs> okay, let's head home. With some Kelf. Hello, Moo Kelf. Yeah. No, oh, it's all locked. Okay. No point worrying about it. Oh, what's that say? Really? No, can't click on it. Well, that is, ladies and gentlemen, ooh. Yeah, there we go. A dandelion. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? I'm probably not going to get through here. I'm not going to get through there. Because <laughs> I, I honestly do not have the energy to do it. Well, shoot. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, wild horse radish, nice. It's probably a good thing I did come back this way. I would have missed that. Well, shivers. That's annoying. This now means I've got to go the long way home. Mm. It would have been a nice little shortcut to get home, but still. I don't want to uh, part... Well, things, as I said, if, you, if your energy runs out, you pass out, and yeah, you end up with a medical bill. Because <laughs> they've got to call the doc to come in the... Revive you. It's not good. You, I think you lose like 60 gold or something. Come, Bob Ross, get home. <laughs> uh, is there anything else I can chuck in there? Um, ooh, should I risk it? Hmm. Yeah, let's do it anyway. Let's let's do some of these things just for a bit of a uh, bit of extra uh, moolah. Excellent. All right. Probably really shouldn't have, but I'm going to do it anyway. Anything good in there? I'll just dump that in there for now. Keep the watering can on me. I didn't plant those seeds. Um. Actually, you know, what? I'm actually going to do it right now. Yeah. Let's get them planted. Since, since I've got a bit of extra energy back now, I might as well just do it. All right. So don't have to watch the TV. We already saw that. And let's go to bed. Nighty night. <laughs> All right. What did we make? Ooh. Ooh, not bad. We've made an extra 237 gold, ladies and gentlemen. Excellent. And saving the game. That is day one complete. <laughs>